Whoa, what's that mob? It's the biggest mob. Key to kid. Welcome back to my channel. No label to label. If you like power like I love power, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe, turn on that post notification bell so you won't miss any other videos I have on power. Episode 9, A Last Gift. In episode 8, Sacrifice, it ended with Sax and Theo being murdered. Theo was released from prison due to the help. I said prison. I meant to say prison from the help of Sax and Davis McQueen. Davis McQueen is Theo's brother. Theo killed himself after he shot Sax. Davis told Theo that Sax was a red bass to the snake, a CI. And Theo wasn't going to let that slide. So he made sure he handled that business for Big Brother. You know what I'm saying? Because Sax knew too much and that information getting out to be crucial. Effie Morales was also arrested after having sexual intercourse with Kane Tata. They ended up hooking up with each other due to unfortunate circumstances of Tariq and Effie getting breaking up because of Effie's careless mistake of murdering Lauren, which she thought she did completely which she found out in episode 8 that she didn't when Laura pointed her out and said, yeah, that's the bitch that killed me. So in episode 9, A Last Gift, the title has a meaning, as all the other titles does in the Power Universe. Sax is haunting everyone from the grave, A Last Gift. He's sending out plenty gifts just like James St. Patrick, including Jenny. He left her a letter just like everyone else. In the trailer, you see it says that. Zach says Tariq set me up to get arrested. Find out what you need to find out. This could be a fucking setup, D. Sex is a sneak or something. He is still causing hell from the grave, just like James St. Patrick. Sex is not one to be played with. So, Sex was basically saying in the letter. That, you know, give this to Monet. Let her know that Tariq is the reason that everything is going wrong in her life. From Zeke on down to Diana getting arrested. All because Tariq is working with the feds. So now Diana is on the hunt to find out what she knows from the orders of Monet. Monet thinks this is a setup, but she is kind of believing the letter that Tariq is working with the feds. That he is a CI. I don't know why she would believe that, but she does. So Diana goes to confront Tariq to see what he got going on. So she's like, Tariq, Sax told me that, you know, that you're working with the cops and you're the reason why I got arrested because you told me where the lockers and stuff. And Tariq was like, man, I ain't been to them lockers in a long time. You know what I'm saying? Why would I be trying to get you wrapped up with the feds when I seen what they did to my family? You know what I'm saying? You tripping, dog. Yeah, you see a Snoop and other Tariq mattress finding that Whitman file? Yeah, Tariq had to leave and take a call. So she ended up going finding that file. Yeah, because after Tariq and Kane end up fighting in Davis' office, you know, they, they bring up the Whitman file. Yeah, this could fuck us. In this show finna do some fucking up some relationships some betrayal and everything you know what i'm saying so diana take that information to her brothers and she like what is going on with this here if this if poppy has something to do with with zeke's and monet found out from Tariq, you Tariq must have been the one that told her because she, he the one got the file. You know what I'm saying? And Kane was like, man, look, it was an accident. So they like, Kane, you knew about this? And he was like, man, it was an accident. He ain't know that that was Zeke. He thought it was Dante. He thought it was Mecca. He thought it was Dante Spears. And they was like, oh, no. Monet come home and she was like, oh, I ain't know it was a party. And, and they're like, oh, no, we know. So they end up getting into it, huh? Diana end up fighting. And they, like, let it go. And Monet was telling them Lorenzo wasn't the safe. Y'all acting like he ain't kill Zeke. Y'all letting him slide for that. 
I ain't letting him slide for that. He he sent you out the house, Diana, because he knew you was going to find out the truth. Drew, he set you up to get beat up and all this and, other, and, and, and all this and the third. And and Diana was basically telling them before they came in, was like, man, Monet, she the problem, bro. Like, she could kill us, you know what I'm saying? If she killed her own, if she killed her father, she would kill us. You know, even Drew wasn't on her side, you know what I'm saying? So it really went bad for Monet in that episode right there. I know Latoya will not be invited to any Mary J. Blige concerts just because they got Diana beating up Monet. I just don't see I just don't see Mary J. Blige inviting Latoya anywhere in real life. Simply because they got this these scenes like this. I just don't see it. Random but true. So then Monet end up putting everybody out the house after blaming after blaming Tariq for all of this mishap. Saying was well, Tariq telling y'all this and she they was like, Man, we know the truth. The jig is up. This ain't got nothing to do with Tariq. To read, 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 to read. So now it's safe to say that Tariq is on Monet's bad side. And I'm just saying that to lay some foundation work for the big surprise that I'm going to have to tell y'all. So due to the Rico case and everything going, you know they ain't being able to move on Western Holdings as planned. And not being able to move on Western Holdings meaning they won't have no more money. Not having Norma's money meaning they won't have a breath. Not having a breath meaning we won't have no show. Not having no show meaning we won't. Anyway, so to get time from Obi, he told Braden that he was just going to tell Obi the truth. He ended up telling Obi the truth and he was like, well, I don't care. I'm going to just watch Norma kill y'all. And, and I hope she take her time killing y'all so I can enjoy it. You know what I'm saying? And he was like, man, I can get you some stuff Noma can't get you. You see you see how I'm rocking. You you know how I'm living. I can get you stuff she can't get you. He was like, man, Noma could give me whatever, so you ain't saying nothing. And he was like, man, Noma's the only way my family could get here. And he was like, if I get citizenship for your family, will you buy me some time with, with, with the plug? And he was like, yeah, man, I could buy you some time if you do that for me. So he ended up going to his councilman Tate, you know, to cash in on the Russian shipment. You know, after he done did that for Rashad, he cashed in saying, look, this is my payment. You know, and Rashad was like, look, before, all right, I, I'm, I'm going to see what I could do. But, you know, Western Holdings, you know, I know you over there. They trying to get me over there. Should I do it? And Tariq was like, yeah, man, come on over here. Whole time, that that girl listening, that girl listening, that his teacher, she, she was like, man, I've been doing my research on Western Holdings. They running the scam. They they scamming everybody. Don't, don't mess with them. And he was like, man, look, they scamming over there. I knew that. I knew Tariq was lying. She was like, yeah, Tariq. I be watching him in class. I I I been on him. I been watching him. He just like his daddy. You know he a good liar manipulator. You know what I'm saying. So, he, to you know Tacy, everything is a political upcome. All right, bro. I'm getting tired, and I don't like holding y'all long. That's not what I like to do. So I'm just finna get the running it. I'm just finna get to telling y'all everything else that happened. So Tariq gonna see Too Big. Too Big gonna take Tariq call. He gonna give Tariq some information. He gonna be like, man, uh, if you don't, if you if you want your mama to be safe, and he was like my mama, because Sax sent Too Big a gift, a letter saying that Tariq got a whole bunch of money. This way you can find them. And stuff like that. So, you know, he owed two bit money anyway. So two bit was like, I need what you owe me and 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 um some and some money. And some more money. And Tariq was like, Man, I don't even got my inheritance. Sax was lying. You know what I'm saying? So and he was like, Well, if you want your mama to be safe, you gonna come up with you gonna give me that call. You gonna come up with something. So he called Tamika and was like, Man, my mama in danger. He was like, Don't know she was like, Don't nobody know where your mama at. 
he was like, look, Tamika, just in case, send somebody over there, you know, some Marcus. He was like, I got you in the morning. He was like, I need you to do it now. So then it ended up showing Tasha, Big Mama, and Yasmin. And um, Yasmin out there playing Big Mama like, man, go get that girl for some for some habit to her. She was like, um, Big Mama, just let her live a... I'm just trying to let her um enjoy her childhood. She was like, that's over with. After all this stuff that happened with this family, you know, we got we to gotta abide by these rules. So next thing you know, Yasmin, she see Tariq, and she's like, oh, my gosh, I can't believe you're here. Um, Wait till, wait till Mama and Momo see you. And he was like, wait, just get down, yeah, just get down. And um, Tommy pop up out of nowhere and was finna kill Tasha. And um, Tariq was like, man... I love you, but I'll shoot you. And he was like, yeah, you killed your daddy, so I know it wouldn't be nothing for you to do. And Tariq was like, we family. And Tommy was like, we ain't family no more. Family family don't tell on each other. Family love each other and all that there. And uh, next thing you know, Tariq get knocked out. He way back up. And uh, Tamika there, and, and she was like, um, you was knocked out. They had people dead around you. Your sister and your momo good, but your mama gone. Asking Tariq who could have been looking for, who it was, and this and that. And uh, Davis McQueen, go help Effie. Uh, with Effie, she talk. She talk about taking a. She talk about taking the charge. She ain't talk about ratting. She don't want to flip on Tariq. Kane want her to flip. She like nah. Kane like ain't no time to be acting like you hard. You need to. She like man. I'm not finna tell. You no, know, I got myself here. And and all that man. Looks like we're out of time for today's video. If you like today's video, please give me a big thumbs up, subscribe, turn on your post notification bell if you're new, or if you subscribe and you don't have your post notification bell, please turn on your post notification bell so you won't miss any other videos I have on power. Please let me know what you think about this video in, your co in the comments. It's the mob, biggest mob, Kita Kid. Arr.